fat and protein have always appeared together in nature. I mean, I think fat is something that it has a role to play in, in actually every meal. As long as we're wanting to absorb fat-soluble nutrients from our food, fat needs to be present in order for that. I mean, everybody knows how important vitamin D is, finally. But, you know, uh, but people <laughs> fail to recognize the fact that, that we have to have dietary fat in order to absorb that vitamin D and make use of it. I mean, if you're going for a sugar fix, you know, you might get that spike, but you're, it's going to be followed by a crash. And what we have, you know, in, in this culture day are people with their blood sugar doing this all day long and their energy's doing this all day long and their brain function's doing this all day long and, um, and, you know, and their mental stability is doing that too. So the moral of the story is basically this. The more we can come to depend on fat or ketones for our primary source of fuel and not sugar or glucose, by far, the longer we will live and the healthier we will be.